Hey guys, I'm back. It's Zach Sponsor here. And today, I will be doing a video of my progression on my unicycle. So, I've just got a reason, uh, with COVID going on, I've got a uh, unicycle to keep me busy, to keep me active, and try something brand new. So this is day one, and we are just starting our journey. And I'll take you through a little bit of clips of each day, but little highlights or little moments in them. And every day we did 15 minutes. And man, oh man, what a journey it was. So I hope you enjoy the uh, video. And don't forget to like and subscribe the video. And if you like this type of progression video stuff, let me know. I will keep doing I'll keep learning new skills, learn new stuff. So if you enjoy this content, let me know in the comments down below. Alright, without further delay, I'm going to hit some music in the background and enjoy the show. Okay, so now I'm just going to give you some tips and tricks I learnt along the way. So, when the unicycle falls backward, that's not ideal. We want it to fall forward because we are shifting the centre of gravity forward so we can move forward. If we lean back too back, lean back too far, we will not be able to move off. We will just fall off the unicycle. So, here we go. I'm just explaining how I set up. And that there is what we want to happen. Not going backwards, that's not what we want. So on this attempt right here, um, as you can see here, I'm shifting my weight slightly forward and that was a really good run. The distance to the wall, to the grass, uh, is about 5 metres. So that was a really good run there. Here we go, this is another attempt without the wall support. So I'm doing it freehand, no, no wall support at the start. It's a very different ball game this one, this, this attempt. So right now, I am just showing you what a flat tyre looks like, so you know what it looks like. So if you've got a unicycle and you haven't pumped your tyre and it looks like this, pump it up right now to its whatever its 
says on the tire. Mine says 60 psi, that's how much force or how much air pressure you can handle. So that's what I put in it. Okay, so here I'm telling you to put bottom pedal slightly forward so that when you push on the bottom pedal, the front pedal moves forward and builds the, the, momentum, sorry, the momentum so you can move forward and you can use that momentum to stabilize yourself with the unicycle. So as you can see in this example here, I put pressure on the bottom one, which moves the top pedal, which then allows me to put to uh, follow through with the other pedal. You always want to keep pedaling, you can't stop uh, stop pedaling and you fall off, but you can pedal back and forth, like little shuffles back and forth, to stay still in one spot, but I'm practicing moving forward, not stationary. So in this example here, I'm um, you see I push pressure on the bottom pedal, allow me to build that momentum. And as you can see here, you want to see how my foot's going over the pedal. That's if you can get that to happen before you start doing the more fancy stuff and putting your foot on the pedal, then you are having to step towards the right direction. That there is perfect. That is what you want to see happen. So if you are doing what I'm doing, where you just on your unicycle and then you see that foot push slide past, that's good. That's a step in the right direction. You are one step closer to doing it without the wall. Now, here comes the tricky bit. You put your foot on the pedal. Now, don't worry, it's going to take you some time. You're going to feel like you, you're getting nowhere, but that's just how it is. And uh, right here, I'm just telling myself to push off the left leg and look at that sensational right there. A round of applause right there. So that was a, and that's how you do it guys, so keep practicing. Alright, I'm back. Now, as you can see, I've been trying a while. I got it really good that first attempt, but I never seemed to get it as good as that attempt before. It's a challenge, so um, just keep going, keep hustling, and you'll get it. Oh, wow, we did it. Wow, we did it! Awesome! So, if you just keep going one step at a time, you can achieve it. So keep going, no matter how long it takes. Just take it one day at a time, and then you will get it.
Yes! We finally did it. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time.